Hey, you guys, I am making tonight a stir fry. And this is really healthy for you. Now, I'm making about three servings, so that's why you saw me put about three tablespoons of olive oil into my extremely hot skillet. Now, you can do this in a wok, and I have a wok, but the wok does not want to cooperate with this stove for some stupid reason. So, anyway, all right, so we've got this going. We're gonna warm that up for a second. The next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to put these chicken strips in this hot oil. And we're going to stir fry. Babe, will you get me a, a something to stir fry with, please? A utensil. And there we go. Now, this is going to equal about, thank you, this is going to equal about three ounces of chicken per serving. Okay? I'm going to add some mint ginger and some mint garlic. Mm. Yep. And we're going to let this stir fry. This cook for about five minutes or so. So stay tuned. I'll be back. Okay, it's been right at, it's been right at five minutes. And so you can see the chicken is cooking up nicely. Uh, so the next thing I'm going to put in is I've got some broccoli florets and some cauliflower florets. I'm going to put those in. Mm. This is going to be good. I actually have um, some um, frozen corn here. I'm going to put that in as well. And you know, you can eat all kinds of vegetables. Um, Sean and I have actually been studying up on that. And um, it's like half of your plate needs to be vegetable. So why not? All right, now let's put in some frozen peas. This would be a great meal to put together. Um, when you're short on time coming in from work. And we're just gonna put a little splash of water in there. Now we're gonna let this cook, uh, still on medium high heat, stir frying away for another two, three minutes or so before we add in the rest of our veggies. This has been stir frying for about two, three minutes now. And um, I wish I had cut my broccoli flour. It's just a little bit smaller, but that's okay. In here, I have, I'm using what I have, cleaning out that crisper, y'all. I had a few little Brussels sprouts left, so I just uh, shredded those up along with a zucchini and a couple of really small uh, green onions. So I am just going to stir all of this together for the next couple of minutes or so until it starts softening up. Now you can um, leave the veggies as crunchy as you like. I like them. I like them with a little crunch, but I also like them with. Um, I want them done. I don't want them um, like raw. So, okay. So we're gonna let this go for another minute or two. Okay, you all. It's done. It's ready to go. Mmm. Now, with this, you could add a little bit of um, soy sauce to it if you like, some low sodium soy sauce or some sweet Thai sauce. That would be good. Um, mm, yeah. Look at this. Look at that. Mmm. -hmm. That looks pretty darn good. Top it with some sesame seeds. Dress it a little bit, and you have got you a quick and easy stir fry dinner in less than 20 minutes.
Thanks for watching, y'all. And remember, two bites. What are you waiting for? Hit that subscribe button. Hit the like button. Let me know your thoughts. Or join us on Facebook for more backstories and images. Thank you all for watching. And remember, two bites.